All right, Sarah, show us the menu. Okay, this is the beautiful menu, Spice Bazaar. <laughs> and we can't choose. There's actually so many things. So they have lots and lots of barbecue specials. Um, I've just had a, picked up my first bit of bread. It smells delicious. It's very spicy. Is it? <laughs> It's very spicy, but it's so creamy, it's really nice. Wow. Alright guys, so I've just been invited back into the kitchen. How are you, sir? Welcome in special Yeah, beautiful, absolutely beautiful food. Okay, so I definitely need to work on my pronunciation, but that was the gulab jaman, which is absolutely amazing. I totally had my heart set on kabuki, but I'm, I've been absolutely swayed, and that was seriously delicious. This is going to be quite exciting. We want to show you a little bit of um, the luxurious um, fine dining of Lahore. It's a place called Spice Bazaar. So we're going to wave ourselves down a rickshaw and we're going to go out and um, show you, have some dinner. Okay, so we're going to see us a rickshaw. Yeah, I thought my um, Urdu was going really well and I tried to ask how much does it cost to get a rickshaw. I said, kidna hen, kidna hen. Uh, um, I think I need to work on it. <laughs> okay guys, let's go. We're only just around the corner anyway. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Permission to Spice Bazaar Restaurant. Hopefully yeah. he knows the way. It's actually only about two one, two, I think it's uh, like one to two kilometers or something around here. Um, we're in Gulberg by the way. We're staying at the Rose Palace Hotel where we've been staying. And uh, we're going only a couple of kilometers for dinner. Yeah. Are you guys hungry? Yep. Yeah. How are you feeling today, Oski? Just recovering. Ah, oh, that's good. Here we are, guys. We've arrived at our restaurant with only minor issues. Well, we've arrived. <laughs> with a small detour, but we've made it. Okay, this is the beautiful Spice Bazaar. So when I put into Google Maps around our hotel in Gulberg and I put in to find a Pakistani restaurant on our first night back in Lahore, um, I searched Pakistani restaurant and the first thing that came up was Spice Bazaar. Then I started reading a couple of blogs about restaurants and food in Lahore and Lahore is I think the food capital, one of the food capitals of Pakistan. Um, and it came up under the top Pakistani restaurants to try. So here we are. What yeah. kind of food do you think you're gonna have tonight, Harry? Naan? Okay, well I really wanna have some kind of... And also that chicken karahi. Karahi or handi or something like that. Some kind of forma, something like, we'll see. All right, let's go in. <laughs> All right. How beautiful is this place? I know. It totally reminds me of like you know, it would be like an an old club or something like that. So, as you will probably know. We love street food. We love street food, we love the yep. markets. Um, street vendors are one of our top things to do when we go and travel to a country. But this is something a little bit different, so we want to try... Because people are always forever commenting, yes. try something luxury, show the modern side of Pakistan, go to the malls, or yep. show the you know restaurants that they name. And this was actually not really planned because we put it into Google Maps and it came up straight away. But tonight and it just we're gonna, so happens it's just around the corner from where we're staying. It's just around the corner from where we're staying in Gulberg. So tonight we're going to showcase the 
a luxury side, um, a beautiful evening here at Spices Art and showcase something good. But this is okay. my first time we've shown the luxury side of it, like when we went to the mall. Yes, yes we did show the mall in the San Vardosca, thank you. Thank you for that. Very good, good evening. And where are we staying? We're um, staying at the Rose Palace Hotel, which is yeah. just around the corner. From we here. would definitely recommend the Rose Palace Hotel. It's really nice. Yeah, nice, Gary, and they're very, very friendly there. Yes. But so tonight we haven't got our menus yet. But I've even put on a fresh shirt, tucked fresh myself in. Gave me new that. shirt. Well, I actually got this uh, as a gift a few days ago, so I'm feeling super clean and super tidy. I've only actually I only ever worn it once. So for those of you who say. Gavin, yeah, buy a new shirt. shirt. You wear the same <laughs> shirt all the time. He's got his new shirt. Ta-da! A new shirt. The collar's still even quite stiff, so it's good. Nice. Very good. Good evening. Thank, Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks, bye -bye. All right, Sarah, show us the menu. Okay, this is the beautiful menu, Spice Bazaar. <laughs> and we can't choose. There's actually so many things. So they have lots and lots of barbecue specials. But since we've come out for Pakistani food, I feel like we need to try some of their like karahi or handi or something and um we we're just debating over this one which says murg makani which is it says it's the old time favorite chicken dish with gravy and a blend of butter so i think it's like a um a butter chicken and we're just debating between that one and the mutton handi which one do you vote for Gab? well i am quite interested in the mutton handi because we have We've had chicken before. We've had chicken we've had before. Chicken quite a few times since we've been. Yeah, before. exactly. Yeah, so. Okay. Okay. Shall we try the mutton karahi or mutton handi? The, is there a boneless oh, mutton? The karahi is like the one with tomatoes. That's what we had the, the first night, which is like a tomato-based one. And the handi is like a curry, like. Um, right. I feel like a curry. Yeah. Let's get the handi. I think. Yeah. Okay. And vegetables. Oh, yeah, vegetables. Yes. Get a salad and then. We can ask what the vegetable of the day is. Um, yep. Yeah, it says ask your server for the freshly prepared mixed vegetables selected each day by our chef. Great. So we'll ask. How's the um, atmosphere, guys? The kids' corner over here. Kids' corner? No, it's a beautiful restaurant. And um, should we get some of that writer, which is like the yogurt um, on yes. site? It's like, well, this one says a refreshing treat of homemade yogurt with finely blended mint leaves. So it's like oh, a little I bit of mint. Yogurt. It's got yogurt in it as well. I think we'll get that. Right, okay. We're and ready to order, aren't we? Or some naan. Okay. Right, okay. Happy Oscar? Yeah. Right. I think me and Dad later might be playing this game of cards. Good evening, sir. Good evening. We're ready to order. We think we've chosen. Um, can we please take one? Mutton handi. Um, one vegetable of the day. One vegetable of the day. One. One mint raita. Okay, that's the one that's like yogurt. Um, one fresh green salad. Do you want roti or naan? Maybe a bit of a mixture. Okay, um, two roti and one naan, please. Yeah, okay, so the salad's arrived and this is... This is a writer. So this writer, is like a mint yes. writer. It's basically like a yogurt with a mint. It's kind of like um, basically like you can just, yeah, it's like a sauce. You can just eat it fresh like that, but they sort of put it as a side dish. It's, it's quite like, liquid. Yeah. Yeah. In a nice salad. We yeah. feel like a salad. In this so rice. we've had this quite a few times now, yeah. and it's, it's really, really nice. It's so. really good. In a, in a salad, it's nice. It's going to have that fresh vegetables that have been here. Yeah. Um, and Oski's got some chips over there. We have actually ordered a little bowl of chips. This is the less traditional. This is the less traditional side of the table, and only because Oscar hasn't been very well. Um, he's had, yeah, so we just want him to sort of take it easy. And, yeah, chips his favourite. So um, we've got him some chips as well. He's begging us to let him have some butter chicken and all that. So yeah. nice little salad there, Oscar. Yes. It's a good salad? Yeah, it looks like a great salad. Can I have the salad please? Just to clarify, they're good chips. Alright, thank you. Alright, here comes ours, guys. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. And it looks pretty amazing. Thank you. That must be the... That must be the... Oh, what do we order on the end? Mutton? Mutton. Mutton handy. And the um, 
and the vegetables. So it comes with one vegetable one and one with meat, like wow, mutton. Oh, look at Even that. Even the vegetables of the day, you got some naan and some roti. Looks really, really good. Are you guys, are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. Alright, Gab is on serving duty. This looks amazing. So that is the mutton, mutton handy. And what else? Oh, we got the vegetable. What do you think of vegetables? It looks like onions and like a pumpkin. Yep. Pumpkin dish. Harry gonna try do the trial of some of the mutton. How, what is it? What is it like? It's very spicy. Is it? It's very spicy, but it's so creamy, it's really nice. Wow, very good. Is this Ferrari? No, it's a mutton handy, I think. Oh. Yeah. And so, and that's your lime, fresh lime juice there too. Yes, it's really nice. Oscar, do you want to try some of the fresh lime juice? Or do you want to do a taste test of the mutton on the video? How brave are you feeling? It might be a little bit spicy. I'll go to Gab. How's yours going, Gavin? Um, I've just had a picked up my first bit of bread it smells delicious so. awesome all right are you going to try the mutton first yeah just yeah it's to, really very good i just tried to take my first shred of bread and it's so hot i couldn't is it so straight out of the oven yeah oh very nice so good all right Tell us about the dinner. Well, it's actually, we actually got a little bit carried away and just started eating the dinner without um, reviewing it. So tell it's us actually about it. delicious. Like the mutton just falls apart. Like look at this. This is the mutton dish, and it's just so so nice. Can I actually have some more? Sure. It's so good. Sure. I've tried the mutton. Going in for round two. The, the spice. Are you Oscar? You're liking it. Ah, good on you. Yeah, it but is. Not too spicy. Good work. It is okay. super, super nice. All right. And um, and well, I love the vegetables. I think the vegetables is like a pumpkin and mutton, <laughs> like onions. I think feel like it's onions with all kinds of delicious yep. spices. Yeah. Um, super nice. There's also ginger. It's ginger and there's mm. those long strips of ginger, which is yeah. really good for you. Um, yeah. The yes. long strips of ginger yep. in there. Yep. Uh, anyway, it I, is really, really nice. They do really, a great really job. Good. They do. I feel like you're going to have to go and sit. They've got a huge group in here now, but I feel like you're going to have to go and see. If we can go and see the chefs because it also looks amazing. We can see through the window at the back there. I'm going to try and get us myself into the kitchen so I can give you a yeah. view of the kitchen. All right, guys, so I've just been invited back into the kitchen. So, what was your name? My name is Abdul Moin. Nice. I am a restaurant manager. Perfect. Hi. It's a beautiful restaurant. Here we are. This is our Yes. Hey, uh, most people are working, uh, maybe 20 persons are working in the barbecue section. And the other one is over there. Wow. Yeah, all with this. Yep. And this is our cold kitchen. You can see the, our, you can get desserts yes. and price sellers. You can get easily from there. Yeah. Beautiful. This is. Salam alaikum. It's a tawas section. It's a fry section. Yeah. And it's a fry section. Right. Right. For the cheese is there. He's our executive chef, Akhar Khan. How are you, sir? Welcome, it's special. Yeah, beautiful, absolutely beautiful Thanks. food. We've we'll been back here four times now. Beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Yes, nice thing. to meet you. Yes, please. This is our fry section and curry section. So spice and curry. Yeah, the second wow. section. You can get homeless chickens yeah. with curry and live tuna and something like that. Wow. This is our bread section. Wow. Wow. This is a tandoor section. Yes. Oh, yeah. This is bread. Nice. Bread, yes. You can see. You see here? Very nice. 
Very good. Look at that. I showed you the main kitchen. This is a prepared kitchen. Well done, guys. Prep kitchen over there in Dongshia. Yes. Thank you. So this is all uh, prep yeah. down here. Yeah, see, it's a prep area over here. Right. It's a big prep. Because uh, right now we have two restaurants, five bar. One yes. Is in Boulevard, and second one is DHA. Right. And it's the main kitchen. Wow. All three things are marinated over here. Yes. Yeah. Wow. And over over there, main sauces cooking over there, and for kitchen and butcher area over there. Oh, it's very big. Yeah. Yeah. It's a big one. It's a and Yep. Proper hygienic restaurant. Yes. Alhamdulillah. It's a butcher area. You can see all of Oh, wow. Look at that. Yeah. So butchery's over for the day, but look at that. Look how beautifully clean it all is. Wow. Wow. Sorry. This is our cold area. You can see our cold store. Cold store. Oh, cold store? Yeah. Wow. Look at that. Wow, look at that. And it's nice and cool in here. Yeah, <laughs> look at this, everything's all beautifully covered. When we Vegetables. Oh, that is in this side. Yes. All the cooked this side. Wow, wow. And all the raw. Everything's separated. Everything's all separated. Beautiful. Well done. Well done. Wow, look at that. Big pot. Big so this is all during the day, this is all preparation. This is for main preparation. Yep, the main main mesum plus and yep. everything working in here. Yeah. And after beer shelving for two restaurant. Yeah. BHA and one per worker. Wow. To so this for uh, two restaurant this kitchen manage. Yeah. Wow. And uh, both are restaurant more than thousand per day cover. Wow. That's awesome. Look at that, look at those sauces. Beautiful. And you have a head office over here. Oh, yeah. Head office you want to see? No. <laughs> <laughs> what head office? Uh, uh, staff, meals, yeah. area, changing room. Yeah. This, like, nice. this like a mini five star hotel, not a restaurant. No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. it's very big setup, no? Yes. Or in the restaurant, this very small setup, but here in Pakistan, this one big setup, na? Yes. So it's yep. like you call him mini five star hotel. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Wow, that was awesome. Thank you. Hey, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Have a nice evening, sir. Yeah, thank you. That was awesome. Wow. How was that? That was pretty amazing. Is it? Yeah. So. Like we just saw them coming out with these absolutely enormous platters, like massive, massive oh, platters. These like, huge things of barbecue kebabs. Yeah, yeah. well, I'll tell you what, guys, you should see it. So um, they just took me into the the main kitchen areas, you'll see it all in the video, but then you go downstairs where the, the prep kitchen is, oh, and nice. there's like enormous like cauldrons where they... Um, they make all the biryani. And that's well. where they make all the biryani and all the sauces and all the spices oh, and everything. Here comes this guy, this must be all the naans and the Ah and yes. Look at this. They took me into the bread kitchen as well, oh, with wow. the big ovens. Yeah, this guy is going to be <laughs> carrying out like huge food. Look at that. <laughs> wow. Yeah, no, it's it, um, they're like balancing before this heaps of enormous plates of like um, barbecue and everything on their shoulders. Wow. Out very, yeah, it is oh, it is enormous. Oh, it's enormous. Yeah. Um, they took me to the to the bakery section where they make all the bread. Yeah. They took me downstairs to the butchery. Whoa, so they've got a complete butchery area, and then they took me into their enormous walk-in chiller where they separated all the foods. Wow. Gordon Ramsay would be very Ramsay happy here. Yep. Very the raw meat and the cooked meat were all separate, all covered. It was all labelled, dated, wow. everything. It was beautiful. I, um, I really want to look up. I'm going to look up and I'll put it down on the screen below. But um, how? I wonder how old this is, this establishment is. 
Yes. Because it must have been around for a while. But this is, I think they've got the little restaurants. I think they've got one other spice for that, and then they've got other branches. But that's what he was telling me in there, yeah. So it's all on the video. Oh, okay. It's all on the video. I don't even yeah. need to go, damn, I missed out. Yeah. So anyway, the question, okay, these guys are coming with even more trays. You'll just see. They've got, look at this. Look at all the trays. Wow. These guys are super, super busy. Wow, they're wow. very, very good. Very good. Yeah. Look how many different all the different handy. So I think the difference, I'm going to check, but I think the difference between karahi and handi is like the um, the vessel that it's cooked in, like whether it's in a pot or a um, like, clay yeah. or tin, yeah. yeah. Or the so, metal, yeah. Yeah, so I think that's the difference of how it's cooked. But anyway, the real question now is have you saved room for dessert? I have. I am saved especially room. I really, really want to get a comfy ice cream. We haven't showed this much yet here, have we? In no, I don't think so, no. But um, I'm going to get the menu, but I'm pretty sure they have all kinds of coffee. But I just want the normal, like on a stick. So, kofi is a different type of ice cream that is really popular in it's South really Asia. Yummy. It's really, really nice. It's like a creamy really kind of a cone. It looks like a cone. Like a cone, an upside down cone. Yeah. 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 That's probably like no uh, Maybe. Yeah, I think it is like how they store the milk and it turns into a sort of like extra a creamy. Curd, yeah. Like it sort of, and it kind of separates and so it is so creamy naturally. And so it doesn't need sugar in it, I think. Right, okay. I think it goes naturally sweet. Okay, I'm going to have to look that one up as well. Anyway, I'll ask for the dessert menu when we go to Oh, wow. Wow. Okay, the manager's just brought out these amazing looking desserts. What is the name of the dessert? It's the name of Gulab Chaman. Wow, that looks absolutely beautiful. Oh, wow. Look at that. Whoa, guys, okay, how excited good. are you? Yeah. Wow, thank <laughs> you. Really nice. Thank you so much. Thank you. That looks you look absolutely amazing. This. Thank you. So let me talk you through this. Okay, wow, it just looks beautiful yeah, it how looks it's presented amazing. like that. So this looks like... Okay, I was already like opening over the dessert menu, so that sounds amazing. Yeah. <laughs> okay. This looks like a, um, like a yeah, sweet syrup, so... Wow. Oh, that's real good. Wow. It's really good. What is it like, Harry? Is it hot dessert or is it cold? Mm, is it warm. hot? It's warm? Yeah. Is it like a honey or it's how is like it? It's got like syrup around it. It's really yum. Wow. Now tell me, who remembers what these are? Oh, they're in Bangladesh as well. Ah, maybe. Yeah. So let me just break it open. Look at this. Wow. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that looks so soft, Look at that. so delicious. And the Is syrup. it like a honey or a honey it's syrup? Yeah. I think from Bangladesh, what's it called? Oh, I can't remember the name, but it, it must we'll be the same. Is it with a it's got um, look at it, it's really yum. Okay. It's got syrup all okay. around it, and it's, it's really nice. Or should I try the syrup or something? Okay, I'll try the syrup. That's so delicious. It kind of tastes like coconut. Wow. It's got little bits of coconut in it. Wow. All right. Okay. All right, I'm gonna try mine. That is awesome. Bit of a treat. That's so delicious. I was actually just going to get a try, but Are you glad you got this that? is really nice. <laughs> You're lucky. Okay, so I definitely need to work on my pronunciation, but that was the Gulab Jaman, which is absolutely amazing. I totally had my heart set on coffee, but I'm, I've been absolutely swayed, and that was seriously delicious. So it says that one it is... Was so good. I yeah. Harry can it was so rich. So good. It says that it is lightly fried koya dumplings served in delicious homemade syrup. It tastes like... um kind of like a pudding or like a cake that's been warmed a sponge cake maybe that's been warmed in like a really really soft it's not too sweet it's like a honey it's honey and almonds um in the syrup it's actually delicious are you full now harry it was so delicious honestly look how much i barely harry, dented harry it harry can't actually finish this but it was it's so super, super delicious. rich and syrupy okay have you changed your mind now from coffee to this one yes. we have to remember the name gulab Jaman, was Good a Jaman. And a Koya dumpling was the yes. name of the dumpling. Nice. Anyway, to conclude, it's really good. Okay. okay, well, that was delicious. And as you can see, there's none left. <laughs> there's none left. That How was, was that, guys? Amazing. It was 
so surfing rich, like, and then put it Harry couldn't quite finish this, but that was absolutely delicious. Mm. Yeah, we already talked about it, we gave like a, um, a bit of info about it. We can't quite remember the name in other countries, but here it is called Gulab Jaman, and I'm going to remember that because it's delicious. Gulab yeah. Jaman? It was really nice. And so, are you finished? Do you have any room for a chai now? Or are you I don't think I have room for a chai. That was like totally off, just kind of perfect. Yeah, that was perfect. I think we're going to leave the chai out for yeah. until we get home. Yeah, at least later on in the evening. So um, if you are coming to Lahore and you are looking for somewhere to try Pakistani yeah. food but with the whole atmosphere and the whole yeah. experience, you must come to Spice Bazaar. So yeah. there's two, there's one in DHA and this one here is in Gomberg and um, it, it really is fabulous. The staff, the staff are amazing. The staff are super, super friendly. And the price is actually really good. Yeah, the price is really reasonable and Like you well, can still yeah. eat for a family of four, you can still eat for... 35 New Zealand dollars. Yeah, which is, I think it's like, um, it's about, uh, about 10,000 rupee or something for yeah. a family, or Ooh. maybe between 6 to 10,000 rupee. Or, yeah. Yeah. Which, hey, you know, it's actually really for what this place is because it's very, it's very, very fancy. It's very fancy. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. Even look yeah. at all the waiters, all the staff look so smart. I know. Look at them. And they're so on point. They're uh, so attentive, like they are. The place is super clean. The staff are just all over everything. Yeah. So, Ramsey came, if Gordon Ramsey came here, he would leave them when it because there was nothing wrong. There's nothing for him to do. <laughs> Good stuff, Oscar. It's really nice. Oh, well, guys, right. that was delicious. We've got to show the sweet shop on the way out. So, yeah, yeah. we will get our bill and we will head out and show you the sweet house, which is also another of their businesses like out the front of here. Yep. It just looks like, um, oh, I'd like to live in there. We'll show you on the way out. Yes. Okay. Okay. Hi, everyone. We will. Hi, family. Uh, it's uh, it's our honor to welcome uh, these guys, and we also are just people who are seeing us. Welcome Pakistan, and you also visit Pakistan, uh, try the food of uh, Pakistan, uh, and also uh, have this uh, have the uh, fun with Pakistanis. Oh, so nice. Okay, visit Pakistan. See you soon. Uh, thank you. Assalamu alaikum. हम इनका खुशा मदीन कहते हैं अपने पाकिस्तान मुल्क में इन इनको इन्होंने हमारा मतलब खाना वगैरह खाया इनको बहुत अच्छा लगा खाना फूड ये वगैरह पाकिस्तान घूमे ये कहते हैं लाहौर ही बड़े काइंड हार्टेड पीपल होते हैं और हम आपको दैट्स इट इट्स अ मिथ पाकिस्तान इज अ टेररिस्ट एंड एवरीवन इज देयर टेररिस्ट नो वन इज टेररिस्ट we actually welcome tourists outsiders and we respect them and we give them Hospitality, show them hospitality. Yes. Ah, oh, that's fabulous. Awesome. Shukriya, thank you. Thank so you, thank, thank you. Yeah, thank thank you, you guys. Oh, thank you so much. You. Awesome. You. Nice to meet you. Okay, before oh, we go home tonight, we just need to show you this absolutely beautiful. This is called the Sweet House. I can't remember the name in Urdu, but you have to come and just have a look and show all these amazing sweets. Look this at This is all. like what we had. Jaman, something Jaman. We just had gulab Jaman. Yeah, so they're different. Maybe they're different flavors of that one. Who can find Barfi to... Oh, there you go. There's Barfi. It's the same thing. So it's like a... Little Look at these. Oh, it's sort of like a fudge kind of thing. Wow. We're too full to eat anymore, but we want oh. to come and see these amazing ones. Look at these. They've got like silver... So that's barfi. It comes in those long rolls, like um, yes. and it's like diced up or cubed. This one, these ones. Look at this, like the topping of it. Can we try them? Oh, yeah. yeah. And this one is like a baklava. Yeah. I remember something. No, is, it, is it baklava or baklava? <laughs> it's, it's very delicious. Though. But look at this. Come I think it's baklava. And what do we what do we call this one? But, um, Jalebi, Jalebi. Yeah. Jalebi or? And I remember seeing it popular in India and um, Pakistan. Like, and what is it? They had this, it comes like a really sweet syrup. Yes. Well, that was like what we had for dessert there, Oski. Yeah, but do you yeah. remember it? They would yeah. always get up. Yeah. It's Absolutely like a, delicious. Yeah. So it must be called Jaman here. Yeah. Anyway. Nice. And that All right, we've had such up. an amazing evening and highly, highly recommend this place. Yeah. Spice Bazaar. It's amazing. The Sweet House. The Sweet House in Gulberg, in Lahore. You must come. You must come and check it out, eh, guys? Yeah. All right, you want to sign so, off for us? We're going to sign off right here from the Sweet Shop in <laughs> Gulberg at the Spice Bazaar. And we will see you on the next day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs>